morning guys, welcome to today. I'm playing this really fun game and I'm gonna race again. Race? Yeah, let's watch. All right, here we go. Go, 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 Go to work. Cupcake Click wins the race, gets the money. What game is it? This is Rival Stars Horse Racing, and you get to have a farm and grow your farm and race your horses. Kind of like what we've been doing here. You get to breed horses? Yeah, you get to breed horses, you get to get new horses, you get to sell your horses, you can buy new horses, and you get to race your horses. Mm. I'm gonna get that for my phone right now. Okay, I'm in, I wanna play. I'm downloading it right now. If you wanna download this game, click the link in the description box below where you can get it for your iPhone or Android phone. We can all play Rival Stars together. Hi. Oh, Storm, did we not talk about this yesterday? We are not a kicking farm. Hi, Finn. Hi, Willow. Willow? You okay? There you are. Yesterday was so fun for me. And then a catastrophe struck. And if you know me by now, then you know when I say catastrophe, I mean just bad luck. So, basically, you guys know Storm lost a shoe the other day. Oh, hello, pretty girl. So he lost his shoe and the farrier came the very next day. Oh, you drank all your water. Storm. Not you, sorry, him. Stella, you're such a messy girl. Storm lost the shoot. Farrier came and fixed it. And then Gabby jumped Storm in the field yesterday. It was so amazing and everything was good. And then fast forward to last night, we brought the horses in. And the way we do it, we've been doing this. We've been leading Finn because he's our wild card. And so Gabby led Finn, and Storm was supposed to follow along kindly behind, politely behind. Yeah, he didn't. He galloped through the muddy field, and then poof. The other shoe's gone now, so we gotta find it. We gotta find his shoe. Called the farrier, and the farrier's like, oh, Storm. And actually, he didn't say that. I said that. I think he agrees with me, though. Uh, so then, the farrier's gonna get back to me with when he can come. But yeah, like... If you gallop through the mud with your shoes on, there's a chance that they could come off. The opposite one to last time. So did you see I put these here last night? Yeah, that's good. What? Wait, 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 wait. It's about time, that's good. <laughs> Thank you. Quick update, uh, the guy that is working on our farm and putting everything in for us came by yesterday and I had a big talk with him and he told me that where we wanted the arena was genius. Sam had such a good idea and I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. That was not Sam's idea, that was my idea. And he said Sam totally told him it was his idea. I was like, yeah, of course he does. Of course he did. But anyways, so he's gonna be taking the manure with him because he's a farmer and he has fields and he's spread it on his fields and 
yeah, like I had a really good talk with him and tried to figure out what we're going to do and how it's all going to get done. So uh, one thing he did say, which was unfortunate, was that uh, once everything dries up, he's going to be here. No, once everything dries up, he has to plant his fields and then he's going to be here. But yeah, that, that's what happens when you live in a farming community. Everybody's going to plant their fields. If I was a shoe, where would I be? Boy, oh boy. I just don't want Finn to get hurt. Look, they left so much hay yesterday. So there's not much grass in here anymore and I want to open it up. I want to open it up and put willow. I want to put all my horses together, even though it's not necessarily the best idea because certain things could happen. I just feel like they're going to be so much better together. Uh, Sam's going to come in soon, as soon as this thing dries up rip this little pile down and spread it and it'll be like less muddy hopefully <laughs> and they'll have like all flat and it'll be bigger and as soon as the guy comes and gets all this stuff then we'll be able to make this paddock way bigger you need to get a metal detector have a metal detector i think we need to invest in a metal detector storm in his shoes the other day we needed more hay and our regular guy did not message us back he was away so Sam ended up buying this stuff from a Mennonite farm. I don't know if you can tell, it's not packed as tight. It's like not as neat and uniform in shape. And it's really hard for me to gauge like what is a normal amount of hay. Like what, like see, this part's all really short. Like it's all, I don't know, it's just weird. Doing the hay has definitely been like a big huge thing for me, like a big huge struggle. It's not as easy as it looks. Like Stella gains weight every single mistake I make and then she loses weight every mistake like she's she's oh man she's just hard to manage everybody is just hanging out waiting for storm to finish storm gets the most grain obviously um and he's, he's faster than Nikki so that's something on our show morning like our very first show when I got all wet and I was wait 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 is this gonna be another coffee moment I didn't have coffee okay go ahead then um we had to wait, we all had to wait for Nikki to finish her grain, which she gets more than Storm, like a lot more, and she takes forever to eat it. Yeah, and Storm is a slow eater too. So we're just all waiting, the hay is all out, we're just waiting for everybody to be ready. So the boys have to go out first, and i am just been bonding with our willow. You're a good patient boy, you're not a patient girl, but Stella... <laughs> Stella's patient. Doesn't her stall look like it glows with that light? Like, I feel like it glows. Will Willow, look, Willow does not eat her grain in the morning. Unless I hand feed it to her. Don't you want to have a good breakfast before you go out? Hey. Eh? Today on the agenda is Willow and Finn, who didn't get much attention yesterday. But first we have to do school. Sam and Sophie got back really late last night, so Sophie's sleeping in. Nobody's going anywhere. Just hold on. Hold your horses. So many expressions come with horses. Hold your horses. Don't yank my chain. Comment below any horse-related um, phrase that you can think of. You only make you feel like you could never leave. Do the same, we can't go back. This is all we need. Follow me to make believe and make it come true. This night means forever and so does me and you. We say we love, we say we love. We gave it all, we gave it all. We say we love, we say Thing we ever did was get a dumpster. I took a vitamin today and literally I've been on fire. I've been cleaning out the barn. Yeah, getting Sam's stuff all put away. That moment when you discover that your mother-in-law sent home leftovers. Meatballs, What's that on ribs. Gabby, are these your ribs? These are your ribs. Those are mine. Oh, ribs and meatballs and sausages. All of our ponds are getting smaller and smaller. I tried to jump over this the other day and it collapsed. See that big crack? And it collapsed and I almost fell in the water. Another thing that we need more of is 
tack cleaning stuff. Um, Gabby has, so we don't have any oil. I have like conditioner and cleaner, but no oil. Gabby has cleaner and oil. Oh, yeah, soap and oil from Devaku, but she won't share it with us. I do have this stuff, and I bought it um, from a lady at a flea market, and she said that what her friends do is they put it on their horse uh, because the smell deters flies and bugs. But it's oil, and I don't want to put this, like imagine I put this all over storm skin, and it's oil, and it attracted the sun like he'd die. So I might try a little bit on their tail, but I'm probably not going to use this. It's supposed to be 21 degrees Celsius today. And let's do, oh, she's taking it off. Let's just say Gabby's wearing a coat. I wore a coat. Um, we're probably playing with the ball. I don't know if they play with and the ball. And change it. Well, yeah, change you went away for a whole day and I changed everything up. I changed buckets. These are the ones that Danny the horse girl gave us and I think they're better for the girls because there's two of them and it holds enough water. And things are drying up. Oh, I see what's happening here. Are you gonna take her in and groom her? Okay. Pretend it's Stella. Okay. okay. Pretend it's for Stella. Stella's like that. Better not be for me. Yesterday I had to take Stella out and groom her, and she ran. She saw the halter and ran. Tag team. So Sophie came out here to spend time with Finn, and Finn bucked Storm. Really? Look at, see this is what Storm does when there's a fly. Sam did get, oh that's a bee. Yeah. Storm, or. Why do horses not get stung when they do that? And we get stung when we run away from them. It's crazy. Are you doing the same thing? I think this guy's just copying this guy. Do not learn bad habits. He just snotted on me. <laughs> so rude. Anyway, they're like, take me out. Let's go for a run. We're gonna, oh, Storm. Yes, I know I don't need to tell them to be good. Look at you, you guys like didn't even eat all your food. Like you don't even eat your hay. Storm, don't be grouchy. Storm is just running him off without even pinning his ears. I know. Uh, hi Storm and your one shoe. You can't get out and do anything you have one shoe. Willow was supposed to see the vet today, but, whoa, where are you going? But our vet is coming in two weeks anyways for our yearly immunization and Willow's been doing so much better. I'm like, why am I gonna call the vet here? Like, come check Willow who's doing perfectly fine when you're coming back in two weeks anyway. So I canceled and he's coming in two weeks to do their vaccinations and I'll just uh, tell him what happened and well, he already knows what happened, but he'll do another checkup on her. So little Miss Winnie, Minnie yeah. Winnie, is uh, getting on her saddle. So that saddle pad is definitely all the way up her neck. <laughs> yeah, I got a little back. It's a little big. Look how cute. She's all relaxed. She just like. I know. I saw that. I don't know what that means. Yeah, like, I I'm a paranoid mother, you guys. I like see them and they're like shaking their skin to get the flies away, and I'm freaking out. I'm like, oh. She's overheating! Like, what are we gonna do? Because I just, I, uh, she's just a... Paranoid mama. She just freaks out over the tiniest thing. I do freak out over like, the tiniest thing. Like, if they have, like, a little bite on them, she gets all... She's like, oh my god! Oh my are you gonna god. be like that when you grow up? I'm gonna die! Are you gonna be like that when you grow up? Probably not. Poor pony. She's like, there's a polar wrap on them. Sophie is so much better at doing hooves than me. Yesterday I did Stella's hooves and it took me a long time. Yeah, because you don't do this. I know. I, oh, I don't have a lot of practice. in there. In Stella's? No, in store. Ooh. You have to get it all out. But we were just interesting until something better came along.
nodding is good for something. He can hit the ball with his no, head. Actually pushes it. Yeah. yeah. Right, I am getting this section of our barn cleaned up. We got the fridge ready to go for drinks. No, 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 no. You're not freezing up in there. Get out of the fridge. It's for drinks, not for kids. Back it up, sister. It's, I just plugged it in. Did you know that the more you carry it, the better you can? Even I can carry it now. Whoa, what the heck is that all about? <laughs> you miss your Sophie? Or you miss your Stella? I'm coming. <laughs> you want some water? Let's get some hay for them. When I took off his halter and walked away to grab the brushes, he followed me. Did he? As soon as we wake up, promise you the world tonight, I'll show you what I've got. Your body speaks my language. So yeah, she's not allowed to be riding him because he... I can't walk him. Right, she's just walking. I can't do her. No, and, and no saddle. Aw, he's really in love with you, so... Senorita like a book. This night means forever and so does me and you. What? Treats. No. Scratches. When he does something good, I scratch him. And he loves that, so he learns best with this. We're getting so good. And I did not want to use treats because um, uh -huh. he's that like. You're his new mare. Seriously. Sam and I just spent the whole entire afternoon out in the backfield because Storm's a black horse. Well, he's a bay horse, but he gets so hot out there that he's miserable and the flies are bugging him and he just gets miserable. He's like a grouchy old man horse. So he tries to find the shade and there's literally only one tiny spot of hay, of shade and it's in one back corner and he goes and he stands there and it was just like a disaster back there. So I went back and there were some like bricks there and there were some logs there and we had to cut up a bunch of vines and stuff. Like could you even imagine? Anyway, I cleaned it all out so that he can go back out there, but it is beautiful in here, nice and cool in here, and this is what I want. I want to be able to open the door and all four of our horses to just like run in and out when they need to and have this to play in, to be out of the sun, but Fiona said I'm not allowed to integrate them again yet. Like, I think they're okay. Like, we bring them in and out all together, like, and they don't even notice each other. They don't even care, but we're always here, and we always have, like, Storm on his halter and stuff, and we can always kind of keep uh, Willow behaving and stuff. So, yeah, soon, though. Soon I'm going to try it, because there's no way they're going to be able to stay outside all, all the time in the sun without a shelter. Isn't it nice in here, though? Like, it is so cool in here. In fact, you should open that door, get a breeze going. <laughs> Door. We say we love, we say we love. We gave it all, we gave it all. We say we He is much happier inside. Look, totally different horse than he was outside. That's good. Wow, that's a lot of hay. Okay, no more. That is so much hay.